Music and art are a medium that everybody understands. I heard about this contest through my English teacher and I wanted to participate because I felt that the mission of this organization and of this celebration of art was something that I really felt connected to not only because of mental health but also because of the advocacy portion of it. I want to let people know that they're not alone. This art needs to be seen throughout the state by everybody. Um, when people see this work, they're just, they're really blown away. I'm so grateful that they have the opportunity to use their voices to share their experiences so that others know that there are other people that are going through the same types of things. So this has just been a joy to be part of. I think it's so important to be creative and express how you feel in general and especially about mental health because everybody deals with some type of challenge in their life that maybe they don't talk about or they don't have um, anybody to talk about it with. So being able to destigmatize that and give people a space where they feel comfortable and um, confident in expressing how they feel is important. I'd want them to know that their voice is heard by them showing their courage in whatever means they expressed it in, that people are going to hear it, they're going to make a change for people to see what our students are going through. We didn't know how to do that in our generation and they're teaching all of us. And I think that this literally shows them as they sit in an auditorium with 50, 60, 70 other youth and it's like, oh, it's, I'm really not alone. So it's great for them to see that with their peers. I think students really benefit from Magnify Voices because it gives them an opportunity to showcase their work in a way that is very vulnerable and really listened to and respected. I also think that it helps us as a community as we can all benefit from a rich artistic society that has a chance to communicate 